اعوذ باللہ من الشیطان الرجیم بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم In this session we are going to look into how to perform moderation analysis with categorical moderator in seminar Now a quick recap as to what needs to be done again the first thing is step 1 call in the library step 2 load in your data just call this function head with the data to assess whether you have got the data right or not so what you need to do is simply select this run and just double check your data all good yes all good the next step you have to create your measurement model now how do you create your measurement model you create the object simple underscore mm or you can name it any any way you want just make sure there are no spaces in the name the constructs function parentheses the composite function within the the constructs then the name of the construct in the model and it has got multiple items in this case this is how you have defined it in the data file so oc1 oc2 oc3 4 5 6 7 8 now once you have defined one construct comma now define the other construct the other construct and this is my categorical variable private and it's a single item and it is shown as type here in the data set so private when there is one here this means this is private sector bank that is the respondent belongs to a private sector bank this is public sector public sector public sector so one here means private sector bank zero means public sector this means the respondent is from private or public sector bank now what you need to do is you need to create an interaction term for moderation you will need interaction term you have to call in this argument this function here and what is your iv oc is my iv moderator is private and the method is two stage again the other interaction effect so i've got two relationships that are being moderated by the type of bank the parenthesis closes here now once you have done the measurement model again you need to have the structural model that is your outer model and the inner model both of them should be here again these are the relationships this is your structural model this is the object this is the function and this is how you do your relationships again look at the interaction effect oc is your iv type of bank is your moderator so the interaction of oc into private where is this private here it is how you defined it or how you named it in the model not in the text file in the model and it affects cc so my model actually is like this let's have a look at the model oc pos type of bank then there is oc into private just the short form pos into private obviously this has to be written in full and what they are doing is they are affecting cc collaborative culture now let me show you this model how it is done in seminar now once you have done the structural relationships the next step you estimate your pls model as we did or as we normally do in pls estimation and then you've got your summary object to store the results from pls or pls algorithm here and then look at the plot here let's run it now here it is look at this pos private that is your categorical moderator oc into private pos into private and that is the other construct so your categorical moderator is moderating the relationship between the continuous variables or the variables on matrix scale and finally now you have to you have to run your bootstrapping again make sure you define your measurement model with all your constructs your structural model to design these relationships as we have done before then you estimate your pls model 
just look at the model this is the model that i want to test all the relationships are there yes all good then we run bootstrapping to estimate our results and see whether our hypothesis are significant or not so this is bootstrapping is running just hold on seminar model successfully bootstrapped you need the summary put the bootstrapped model into the summary let's have our results let's have our bootstrap spots here it is so again once you do bootstrapping you have to put in the results into a summary object and then retrieve the results from summary object like this and here are your results look at this these are your estimates these are bootstraps mean or sample mean standard deviation t statistics significant so moderating effects are significant look at this both of these are significant why because this value here is greater than 1.96 so the type of bank does moderate these relationships now how does it moderate negative sign here now what does this negative sign here means this negative sign here means that public sector banks have a stronger relationship between POS and CC. Private is moderating the relationship between POS and CC. OC and private. So in private sector banks, the relationship between OC and CC is higher. So this is in public sector banks and this is in private sector banks. The relationship between POS and CC is stronger in public sector banks. Whereas the relationship between OC, that is your organizational commitment and collaborative culture is stronger in private sector banks. Now, once you have identified that, yes, the relationships are significant, you need to perform your slope analysis. And how to do this? An Excel file for binary moderator by Jeremy Dawson. The link will be shared in the description. And if you look here, this is your IV, OC. This is public sector bank identified by zero private sector bank identified by one what is your independent variable that is the impact of oc on cc so what's the path coefficient here i have a look oc to cc 0.261 here it is 0.261 moderator that is private to cc private to cc that is your moderator to your dependent variable 0.131 here it is what is your interaction effect now in this case i'm drawing the slope for what which one is it oc to cc here it is ot to oc to cc 0.210 now once you put in these values this is your interaction effect oc to cc you will have this slope now how do you interpret this slope now the results are significant your moderating effect is Look at this, it's positive, this is positive, this is positive. Now this means that private sector banks have a stronger relationship between OC and CC. So in private sector banks, the relationship of organizational commitment with collaborative culture is stronger. Now further, this is evident here as well. Look at this, these, these dotted lines showing private sector banks this line or this gradient is much steeper so in private sector banks if you increase organizational commitment there is a stronger change in collaborative culture however for public sector banks look at the gradient it's much straighter in comparison to this one here so in public sector banks although you are increasing organizational commitment and it is leading to an increase in collaborative culture but it is not that strong as it was in private sector bank or other banks. So this is how you can perform your slope analysis in seminar. Again, you can use the other example here. This is between POS. Again, the negative sign here. Look at this. Independent variable moderator and interaction. So here is your POS to CC 0.564. Here is your moderator to the dependent 0.131 and here is your interaction effect 0.224 with a negative sign and again we have already discussed what this negative sign means look at this here the steeper which one is steeper now in this case 
public is much steeper. Now in public sector banks, if you increase POS, this leads to a higher change in collaborative culture. However, if in, in comparison to public sector banks, in private sector banks, if you are increasing perceived organizational support, this is not leading to a similar change in collaborative culture as it was leading to in public sector banks. So there is a change in how POS influences collaborative culture in public and private sector banks. And is this change significant? Well, yes, it is significant because look at the T statistics here. Greater than 1.96 and there is no zero in between. Look at this. Interaction effect on CC. Confidence interval lower level. Confidence interval higher level. And there is no zero in between. Look at this. The interaction effect of OC and private on CC. 0 0.108, 0 0.298, no zero in between. And the T statistics is greater than 1.96. So both interaction effects are significant. So type of bank does moderate these relationship between POS to CC and OC to CC. I hope this session would have helped you understand how to perform moderation analysis with a categorical moderator in seminar. Thank you very much.